Hello and welcome to Rando Tech Info. So today we're testing a new app that just hit the Google Play Store that allows you to test your phone's water resistance without water, or at least so it claims. The app is appropriately named Water Resistance Tester and apparently it was first spotted by Android police. And in this video today, we're going to test if and how the app works. The app is free to download and use. However, you can throw a little bit of money the developer's way to remove ads. Also keep in mind, unless your phone has an internal barometer and an IP rating, this app will not work. So the phone we're gonna be using today is my Galaxy S21 Ultra because it meets both of the criteria to use the app. And what we're going to do is we're going to run two different tests. We're going to run one test with the phone, just normal as is, and then we're going to run another test without the SIM card tray. Obviously removing the SIM card tray will create a huge gap or a hole in the frame of the phone, which should stop its water resistance. So if the app works, it should say the phone is water resistant when the tray is in and that it's not water resistant when the SIM tray is out. So this is the screen you're agreed with when you open the app and you can see current device. It shows my Samsung up top and it says, this app will help you test whether the water resistance seals on your phone are still intact by using the barometer built into your phone. Do note that the seals can become compromised with drops and device aging keep your phone away from all liquid. So it's basically saying, yeah, just because we say your phone is water resistant, don't sue us if it gets damaged by water. So SIM tray is in for this test. So you can see in the top box here, it says average pressure and then it says current pressure. And then it says, please firmly press on your phone screen with both thumbs. So we're going to press down with both of our thumbs. And there, that was very quick. Uh, your phone's water resistance seals appear to be intact. So it definitely thinks the phone is water resistant with the tray in. So now let's test it with the tray out. So the SIM tray is out. We're gonna go ahead and press on the screen with both thumbs, which I'm doing now. This is definitely taking longer. Okay, there we go. Status, your phone does not appear to be water resistant. Try pressing on the screen firmer. Well, I don't know that that's going to matter much, but let's go ahead and try it one more time. Okay, so I've got the app reset. We're gonna go ahead and try it one more time. I'm gonna put both thumbs on the screen. Pressing very firmly, and yep, your phone does not appear to be water resistant. Try pressing on the screen firmer. We're not going to try again because we've already done it twice. So the app does indeed work. When the SIM card tray was in, the app said that the phone was indeed water resistant. And when I had the SIM tray out, it said the phone was no longer water resistant. And I can actually see some practical applications for this app. For example, let's say you send your phone in for repairs or you accidentally drop your phone. To be able to still test the seals on the phone and make sure they haven't been compromised without actually having to submerge your phone in water is actually really useful. Speaking of useful, if you're finding this video useful, feel free to sub to the channel. Smooth. Well, that's all the information I have for today. As always, I really do hope you found the video useful. Thanks for watching. And until next time, this is Rando Tech Info, signing out.